Is there a difference between a kinesiologist and a registered kinesiologist? So not really. Okay. Um, if you want to be a kinesiologist in BC, you just have to be uh, with the BC Association of Kinesiologists, okay. BCAK. Basically, you get insurance and you make sure that you have the degree requirements gotcha. and then you can pay your fee and then you're in the BCAK. Gotcha. With well, the yeah. BCAK, what is that fee? If you remember. I think it's about 310. Okay. I think it's about three. And then you have gotcha. continuing education credits that you need to get to keep gotcha. it up. So every year you need, I think around 20 and they have different units depending on what you did. Like you can do right. self-study, you can take certifications, right. write tests and stuff. And with those degree requirements, is that just mm -hmm. simply having a kinesiology degree? Basically, there's a couple courses that are specific, like you, maybe some phys ed degrees might right. not quite get it. So definitely look at the requirements, but gotcha. most schools and degrees, it seemed were covered to get, be registered as BCAK.